Hey everybody, hope you guys are all healthy and safe. So today we have an unboxing of the GN Smooth X Gimbal. So GN, it's a brand that you either know them very well or you may have never heard of them. If you only follow smartphone YouTube videos, you may not have heard of them. But if you are, if you dabble in photography at all or you watch any of those filmmaking YouTubers, you will have heard of them because they make all the camera gimbals and camera tripods, camera bags, just a lot of camera accessories. So. This one's obviously for smartphones, but I'm excited about this because this is a really small gimbal. Wow, this is awesome. I'm loving how small this is. The fact that both of these fit into the small pouch. Let me grab my DJI Osmo Mobile, which was previously the smallest gimbal I've ever used. So this is my DJI Osmo Mobile 3. So before this came around, I was in love with this because of how small it was. But the GN Smooth X is, seems to be even smaller. Let's just rip this off. I mean, this, keep in mind, this is already really, really small because gimbals used to look like this. So yeah, this is another GN gimbal that I purchased like two years ago. Look how huge this thing is. This is how smartphone gimbals all used to look like just two years ago, a year and a half ago. And then now Chinese companies just keep innovating. We got something this small, shrunk to even this. All right guys, I've tested this GN Smooth X and it actually works. So not only does it support an iPhone SE or an iPhone 11 Pro Max, but it also supports the iPhone SE with a moment lens, which is huge because that's one of my preferred uh, mobile shooting setups when I don't want to use a proper camera. So setting up is really easy. You just have to turn on the gimbal. There's a switch right here. And once you turn it on, it automatically goes into action. And one of the specialties of this gimbal is you can extend it like so. And then you can tilt it forward too. As you can see, it is working. So now there is a shortcoming with this gimbal is that it is only a two axis gimbal, not a three axis. So two axis means you can move it two ways. It moves this way, panning left and right, and rotating like this. So I'm gonna use my head as an example. It can pan left and right and rotate like this, but it cannot look up. It cannot tilt up and down. That's the third axis that's missing here. On a traditional gimbal, like the much larger GN Smooth 3 right here. This one's three axes, but hey, I would willingly sacrifice one axis to get something this much smaller. So the fact that you can extend this allows me to get angles that I usually would not be able to get. Like I can walk with this elevator and I can get a higher field of vision than I normally would be able to get with just a gimbal. So as far as stabilization, it actually works as advertised. So let me do a quick test. So I've already turned it on. I'm just gonna run really quick. So as you can see, the footage is relatively stable. It's not as smooth as a bigger gimbal because this is ultimately a little bit smaller. It's pocket size. But for something this small that actually fits into your pocket, this is really amazing to have something like this. Okay, so the best way to use the GN Smooth X is to download the companion app ZY Cami. This is available on the App Store for iPhones and also the Play Store for Android devices. So once you use the app, now you can control recording with actual buttons right here. So you hit the red button, it will begin shooting. And you can also control panning and zooming with a slider right here. Although if you're zooming with the iPhone SE, it is just completely digital zoom. Now, as you can see, I have the phone in portrait orientation right now and it is stabilized. If I double tap on the mode button, then it goes into landscape orientation and you see it is also stabilized. I can switch modes by triple tapping on the mode button. Then it becomes like, now I'm locking the, the panning. So now it just stays pointing one direction. I can switch it back and now it should pan as I move the gimbal. Well, these are pretty simple gimbal instructions that everybody knows how to use a gimbal will use. Now there are other features you can do too, such as you can track subjects in front of the camera by simply drawing in the sh area, like covering the person. Well, now let's follow this guy. 
see the gimbal is moving around following subjects. So this is good for if you want to just put this on a tripod and then you can track yourself and station and then you can move around the camera and it'll follow you. You can also set recording with a gesture. So let me turn on the gesture. So gesture is pretty simple. You just have to raise your hand and it'll automatically begin shooting in three seconds. Now, as I mentioned, despite the small size of the Smooth X, it can support an iPhone SE with a moment lens, which is very important because I shoot with a moment lens a lot because it really improves uh, video quality and especially gives you a wider field of vision. Now, you just have to push the camera down a little bit to get that center balanced. And then now, now you see it is balancing the moment lens on the iPhone SE perfectly fine. For something this small, that is amazing because this larger GN Smooth 3, even this cannot support an iPhone with a moment lens before. So now with the moment lens on, I can pull out the stick and I can shoot something quite cinematic, like wide angle field of vision and it's stabilized. I can tilt the gimbal like this, it's shotgun style. So anyway, I'm really impressed with the ZN Smooth X, considering how small this is. And the price is really good too. This is selling for just 450 Hong Kong dollars. So that's about 50 bucks US, 50, 60 US. The price might vary depending on the region, but I'm pretty sure it's gonna be under 70, 65 bucks, no matter where you look. And for this price, this is a no brainer accessory for anyone who owns a smartphone and wants to shoot video footage for the YouTube channel or even Instagram, like, you know, or for TikTok, whatever the case. It, um, the package comes with a tripod as mentioned, so you can also just prop this up as a tripod if you don't need the gimbal. Anyway, so that's about it for this first look at that GN Smooth X. I'm gonna have more videos coming up, so if you're interested in keeping up with all the latest tech, please subscribe to my channel. Stay healthy and stay safe.